now in school, I'm studying chemical reactions. So today, we'll be looking at a chemical reaction with sodium bicarbonate and hydrochloric acid. Firstly, we'll need to measure amounts of these substances. We'll start with the sodium bicarbonate and its formula NaHCO3. This is also used for cooking. Now, as you can see, we have 3 grams of sodium bicarbonate. Now we will measure 25 milliliters of hydrochloric acid. Now we will uh, measure how heavy this is in grams. Here you can see it is 94.84 grams heavy. Now that we've got the amounts of both substances, we can now mix them together to see the reaction and the weight after the reaction. Theoretically, it should be 97.84 grams because it is, that is free over the weight of the beaker and liquid. As you can see, the as you can see, the bubble, uh, the reaction is has caused bubbles, and soon we'll measure to see what the weight is. Now that the reaction has taken place, the weight is ninety-seven point five six grams. It is lower than 97.84 grams because some of its mass was taken away with the gas bubbles. Here we have the chemical formulas for the solutions we mixed. Here we have the so sodium bicarbonate. It is made up of one sodium atom, one hydrogen atom, and three uh, and one carbon atom and three oxygen atoms. We mixed this with the hydrochloric acid, which is made from one hydrogen atom and one chlorine atom. Afterwards we got sodium chloride also known as salt. This is made of one hydrogen atom, one sodium atom and one chlorine atom. As well as that we got H2O also known as water. This is made up of 
two hydrogen atoms and one oxygen atom. Lastly, we got CO2, also known as carbon dioxide. It is made out of one carbon atom and two oxygen atoms. As you can see, the amount and type of particle uh, of atoms stay the same in the transformation. In summary, when we mix the sodium bicarbonate with the hydrochloric acid, it made ordinary salt water and carbon dioxide gas bubbles. Here, this is just ordinary salt water, although I'm not going to drink it. Thanks for watching.